Hey everyone, James and Mark here with another mukbang. If you guys are new to our channel, please hit that subscribe button and answer these three questions in the chat. Who are you from? What's your favorite food and how did you find us? My name is James and this is Mark and we film mukbangs every Monday and Friday, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Welcome back to another uh, mukbang. It's kind of, what, it's a couple more days left until Christmas. How many more days? Four? Friday, four, four more days till Christmas. Yeah. Wow. So we're super excited uh, to, celebrate the holidays. I know uh, celebrations will look a little different this year, but I think everyone, like most of 2020, has kind of found a different way to make things work still. So um, yeah, so we're super excited. We're gonna be cooking up a dish that kind of had some ingredients that we had laying around and a couple other things that we picked up. But before we get into all of that, we want to say hi to all of you guys first. So let's uh, see who's here. We got Michael saying, we love shrimp and grits. Uh-oh, the pressure's on. We can't wait to see how you guys do this. We can't get grits here in Montreal. Oh, no. Really? It seems like a very accessible thing. Yeah. We're just got like the Quaker. Do you want us to mail you some? <laughs> it's, yeah, it's, it's, it doesn't, it's not <laughs> perishable. Yeah. Yeah. We got uh, Emerita, Jamie. It has been a while, Jamie, since we've seen you. Yeah, hi. Long time no see. Hi, Chastity. Welcome. Many thousand, thousands of blessings for you, 2021. Yes, we all need it. Uh, Judy is here. And Judy, guess what? We finally got... I felt like you were smuggling drugs because when I opened the box, there's like three bags of... This is the angel poop. So you guys stick around. Judy was so kind to make us, make us three batches, it looks like, of this. And then Mark's favorite, this is, it looks like the toffee. Oh my gosh. So we really appreciate that. you sending that to us. Thank Happy you. Holidays. Happy We're gonna holidays. really enjoy these. So uh, I'm so glad that you're here for the stream so we can say that we got it. Let's see, we got Cindy. Hi, Cindy, welcome. Thank you all for being here. Claimer Huntress is already super buzzed. That's, that's you're my hero. I love that. <laughs> uh, hi, Teresa. Welcome. The food you're about to make, I never had. I'm looking forward to learn about it. Ooh, okay, great. We're super excited to uh, show you guys our recipe. We got Michael Estoy. Hello, James and Mark. Happy Monday of Santa week. Yes. And Cindy M says, what? Tom and Sean are engaged? Well, you know what? You can uh, find out once they get here, if they do get here. Uh, Matthew C says, happy Monday. Merry Christmas, James and Mark. Welcome. Happy Monday. Merry Christmas. We got uh, Candace says, hi, everybody. Welcome. T Beaver says, wow, we cooked this on Sunday. Awesome. Great minds think alike. <laughs> We're just a couple of days apart. Yes. Oh, no, uh, one day apart. Oh, one day apart. Just yeah. one day. Uh, Misa, welcome. So many friendly faces in the chat. We got Elda, Brandon, and Jennifer. Joy B says, uh, sounds delicious. Nora, Julie, Smith, Brenda, who I think we've confirmed we have the same cutlery as her now. Do you want to show the spoon again? I think it's the same. <laughs> and actually, I have to mute to that before. I was wondering what angel poop was. And you know what? Judy could probably explain it, but I actually don't know what angel poop is. is it looks like puff. The digestive um, leftover from angels. It's delicious. It is delicious. <laughs> Stick around. We'll try some on the stream. It's uh, like, I want to say it's like a some kind of corn puff or yeah. some kind of puff, like from a, uh, not. I don't think it's rice. Right. Maybe rice or corn puff that's been coated with, yumminess mm. and it's kind of sweet um but it's well balanced sweet yeah it's also kind of it's addictive yeah it's addictive yeah that's why i got confused if it's called angel poop or angel crack because it's well, I guess supposed to be crack poop comes out of a crack it does yeah <laughs> josephine thank you for reminding everyone to like this video as if we got if we hit those like goals that are on the screen we got to spin the wheel and we got a couple of new things because Mark took full reign of this week's wheels. Yeah, so we'll uh, see. Kind of like unexpectedly, James like, okay, you come up with the wheels. I was like, oh. So there's some of the ones that we always have every week because those are our favorites and some yeah. new ones too. And the new ones, I think, punish me more than they punish you. Why? Well, you guys will have to find out what's on the wheel oh. and you'll know exactly it why. It could be a punishment for me too. I don't think so. That's. I feel like you got off easy this week, so I am taking control back next time. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Family's life. Welcome, Ashley. Hello, uh, Jan. Welcome. 
T Sung Un Lee. The whole gang is here. Desiree, Stray Cat. Oh wow. You got there's Clarissa, Rachel. And tomorrow's my birthday. Oh, Happy early birthday. Can you say Sengil Chukaheo? Sengil Chukaheo. Sengil? Sengil Chukaheo. Chukaheo. Sengil Chukaheo. We hope you have a great birthday. Enjoy. All right. So Oh, Walter is in the house. Walter says, oh, I'm new here. Long time no see, Walter. It's hard to be new here and have the wrench still. It's like kind of impossible. So um, I have to kind of sort through my mind what all the steps are going to be needed to make today's dish. But actually talking about the dish will help me get through it. So we are going to be making shrimp and grits. It's actually pretty easy because we did do a lot of the pre-prep beforehand. So um, we picked up some shrimp at our local market and they're already on skewers. But they're not marinated. So we need to marinate that first. Yeah, so we're gonna marinate that first and like very simple olive oil, lemon, um, some Old Bay seasoning, salt, pepper, very simple and some garlic. So we got that going. Um, and then as far as the grits itself, we're gonna be making a jalapeno and cheddar grit. Our is favorite it, style. Is it plural or singular? Jalapeno and cheddar grits. It's grits. Because I cheated, I looked at the label. It says that on the label? Grits. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, for some reason, when you add all those things, then it gets like a little, you know, hard. It's a, I'll it's a just mouthful. have one grit with the jalapeno <laughs> cheddar. <laughs> Can you what's, imagine? What's the other grit mean? If someone has a lot of grit, what does that mean? Uh, some uh, so gripe, maybe? They have a lot of gripe? Gripe. I don't get is it. Wait, is what? gripe not a word? Gripe is a word, but grit doesn't mean you have a lot of gripe. It, I don't know. Oh, okay. I, I was just like, well, you starting grit with me. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Well, someone look that up for us. And oh, I know, know grit. You know grit. Like, oh, you know what to grit. Like, <laughs> like hella, but grip. Grip load of stuff. Oh my gosh. That's, grip, that's a grip load of grits. Yes. Right? <laughs> yeah, but I think the other grit means like someone that doesn't ever give up. Like they have a lot of grit uh, or like they endure a lot, they can get through it. Has you know? a lot of stamina. Yeah. And, of and the happy couple is in the chat today. Everyone is like, what, whatever about the grits. It's, it's all about Tom and Sean. Congratulations. Congratulations, our new lovebirds. We're so excited. You guys check out Sean IRL's channel because all, all of what went down is, is over there. So check out his latest vlog for today, if you're curious. How it all went down. Yeah. And um, did I did I go through all the steps? Oh, and we're gonna um, put some bacon in the oven as well because you know the grits that I looked up the recipe, there was like crumbles of like crispy bacon on well, there as well. Well, we actually, I don't know about yours, but my favorite way of eating grit is with cheddar and jalapeno. Hmm. Didn't we, we made that recently. <laughs> Lobster, so we lollipop made lobster lollipops on cheddar jalapeno grits. Those are cheddar jalapeno grits. Yeah, we made it. Yeah, I got jalapeno. deja vu when I was making the thumbnail. I was like, this looks very similar. And I was like, I'm sure you could that. just reuse the same thumbnail. You image. know, I don't want to be lazy. I want to like, you know, show yeah, for you was, guys. Those are the lollipop lobsters. Yes. We, it had was it that on this top year? Of, yeah, it was during pandemic and we had it on top of cheesy jalapeno grits. Yeah. During pandemic. It's, it's so weird to think that that's like a a time frame now. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So didn't we was it on our live or were we hanging out with someone? But we coined we thought we were so clever and funny when we said BC before Corona. I think you thought you were clever because <laughs> I was like mm. and what what do we have to drink for today's stream? We have our Sauvignon Blanc, mm. Josh Seller. So I don't know if you remember, those of you who were with us on Friday night, we actually bought two bottles of white wine for the Linguini a la Vogue. Vogue? Vogue. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Balagu? Uh, someone or will Mon save us in the chat. Someone save us, hurry. <laughs> I don't remember. It's like a VOG. Uh, Linguini a la, a la... Linguini a la give up. <laughs> so anyways, uh, many of you wanted us to drink the um, Dark Horse one mm. on Friday. So we had this leftover. I'm perfect. We're eating cheesy grits with is perfect with white wine and same with shrimp. So yeah, it's like we knew we we're gonna do this. So I think we should drink a little bit as we go. Yeah. You know? There we go. Joy says, Von, is it Von Gole? Are oh, we Von Gole. Tanya, welcome. It's been a long minute. Thank you for being here. 
Hope you're enjoying the stream. We yeah. ju we're just getting started. Yeah, and happy Monday, everyone. And yeah. like always, we want to know what you're having for your meal and to drink yeah. today. And while you do that, I'm going to get set up on Twitch because I forgot. So it turns out we were, we got gifted a bunch of subs in our last Monday stream. Was it Monday or Friday stream? And because we're not on Twitch, we don't see that happening. But basically, think of it as the equivalent of like a super chat on Twitch. But we didn't. But know. we weren't able to acknowledge it, and it was. I felt we felt very horrible. Because so now the we're guy like, was chatting, saying, "Oh, I don't think they see my yeah. gift." <laughs> we're, like, we're like, we didn't know. So yeah. when we watched his replay. You could hear him saying like, oh, I don't think they realize, yeah. oh, whatever. So thank you, uh, Swerve TTV. I think that's the name. It has an old thumbnail on here. Huh. Interesting. Okay, well, I still need, I'm, 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 I'm really notorious for like when I need to work on something and then I forget that what I'm, what I was originally supposed to do. You want to go into that deeper? Go ahead. He is like, what's that one character? I don't, I haven't seen the movie, but the squirrel one. Um, Let's You've squirrel. seen the movie. What movie is it? Isn't that Up? I thought it was like Ice Age or something like no, that. No, it wasn't Ice Age. I think it was Up. Like the, it was Russell's, uh, didn't Russell have a friend? The dog, right? The dog was uh, Russell's friend. And then I don't, I don't remember someone, what movie. Like but... it would be doing something and then squirrel. And then it like goes like, wait, can yeah. someone confirm? Oh, Michael says Up. Question oh, was Up. Well, anyway, so yes, James is like that. I'm he gets distracted that. and... Even when like when I see him use the mouse and then I'm like, okay, you need to click on this next, like he'll click on five random things before he gets oh, I, to that. I click. hate when you look at me because I feel like you could see like and he, and he keeps scrolling up and down the browser when you're supposed to just hit next. I'm like, what? You're making me dizzy. Yeah. yeah I'm sorry. Yeah. Anyways, uh that's not a read, it's just true. That's it's T. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Oh, speaking of tea, how did you think our, uh, how many of you guys are here on Friday for our first ever truth or drink? Truth or drink? Someone said, I think it was uh, Eddie who said that should be a normal fixture on our channel. I felt, I rewatched it and I was like, okay, I'm not that embarrassed about how much revealed about ourselves, but let us know your feedback. Yeah. Um, I don't I think I like the dark horse better. Was that what we had on Friday? Yeah. So Mary, it's actually Tom and Sean who are engaged to each other, not Kemu Young and Sean, just to confirm. That could be juicy too. Actually, add that you, to the vlog. Actually, vlogs. can you confirm? We can't confirm that. We don't know it. <laughs> you know what, Kemu Young, what we thought we might transition to doing uh, those questions is we might just end up doing super chat where it is like, instead of us playing that game that we normally play with the cards, super chat us and then we either have to answer the question or drink. Oh. That way it's oh, like, you know, yeah. and then we can then eliminate how we play the game and then, then you it's can, interactive yeah. and we can still play it and it doesn't have to, oh, okay. So if anyone wants to, you know, we could just do a trial run today, we'll see. No, I thought that was for Fridays. It doesn't matter at this rate. Oh, it's like Monday, Friday. <laughs> Monday, Friday, they all blend tomato, together. Tomato. Yeah, if we drink enough, it's like the same day. You say tomato, I say tomato, tomato, tomato. Jay says from Kansas City, had happy hour with a couple of friends, now home and baking. What are you baking? I love, I miss happy hour. Oh my God. we. I forgot about that. I used to do a lot of happy hours at work. You used to do happy hours at work. Sometimes like. Like James will get upset if my happy hour accent like is extended. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let, then, you, do you want to play truth or drink without then, being prompted? And then other way around too. There are times when I got upset too. That's true. That so here's my no, but we do the same thing to each other. It's like we call each other or we text each other, and say, "Hey, I'm gonna be home like in an hour," and then it's like two and a half hours later. We both been guilty of that. Yeah. But although I do try to say, oh, I'm, I'm running late, I'm running late. But then James just says, oh, no, just 20 minutes. And then, then no, nothing. And then it's like five hours later. <laughs> okay, what? No, 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 no. I, okay, well, whatever. I'm going to just uh, drop it. I, golden Road. I told myself that I would work on my communication skills this week. So I'm going to drop it. Is that part of communicating? Not saying something? Um, yeah, so when you drop it, make sure that it's like drop, drop, and you're not going to pick it up tomorrow. <laughs> 
Because <laughs> that that doesn't do Yeah, anything. oh my god. I need a, you Do we have soju in the freezer? Oh, no, let's put some in the freezer. Let's put some in the freezer. That means, can you do that really quick? Thank you. Oh my god, that was really, that was funny though. Like, it it was a jab and it was real, but it was funny. So I can't really be mad. You know what I mean? Sure. Um, Walter, we just typed in fireplace on YouTube and then there's a bunch of uh, videos that's like an eight hour loop. And it actually comes with the crackling sounds, but we don't turn it up because then it'll be like too crackly up in here. You have plenty for my voice, so it's fine. Do we even have <gasps> We polished it all off that one day? We drink three? I guess so. Or is it still in the freezer? What? No. No, I think we drink it all. We have sock. We have the soju. Soju? The other sake? We'll, we'll find something to drink at this point. We have vermouth. We have sock. Yeah. Hi, Noah. Welcome. And people are laughing at your jab at me, Mark. Okay. We, have, we have plum wine, too. Okay. We can so we can that. do that. Uh, Kelly says, shrimp and grits is one of my favorites. Hard to cook the grits the right texture. You know what? I always pretend that it's the right texture, but I don't know. I don't know. We've been lucky with grits. It always comes out okay. Polenta, I feel like it might be a little bit trickier. Mm -hmm. But grits is just, I don't know. Because if, if, if it's too watery, add more cheese or even grits. Oh, right. I always just add more cheese. And if it's too thick, add more water. I don't mm -hmm. know. Yeah. But then it's like you keep doing that and you have like a whole like. That sounds like a cartoon where it like starts uh, to spill uh, over. So oh, I love Lucy. What what is still over in that? When the one? rice kept coming out of the oh. pie and it kept slipping and sliding in the kitchen. Yeah. yeah. If you think about it, rice with butter is probably really close to grits. Like that same that's like what I imagined when I ate rice and butter the first time. Like, oh, this is like the porridge grits that I saw in I Love Lucy. Why don't they make why don't people eat oatmeal with butter and salt? I have. Remember when we were on Duke and Diet? Those were Oat bran, which is different from oatmeal. Well, that has the word oat in it. How much? How much different can it be? What They're is made what is grits made? Wheat is grits every time grits? I say what's grits made out of, people are like it's made out of hominy, and then I'm like, well, what's hominy? It's like a bean. It's no, like, it's not a bean. Hominy oh. is grandma in Korean. Hominy. We're eating a grandma. We're eating. Oh. <laughs> no. 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 Oh no let's not do that. We no. Do that. Not her ashes. No, that's what, oh okay. I thought something different. What do you think? It's not worth me saying right now. Because this is like powdery, so oh, ashes. Okay, we're no. eating grandma. Oh, I was my thinking gosh. like yeah. What do you think? You don't, don't need think to about know. food. No, I'm not thinking about food. All right. Before uh we like dive into cooking, I'm gonna show you guys how we lined up our bacon really quick and then I'm gonna stick that in the oven because if we um cook the bacon ahead of time, that's totally fine. It can just sit there and then we'll crumble it in. So let me grab that really quick. So you guys can see, we actually have a video coming out soon where we kind of talk more about it in it, but nothing that super interesting. But I just took a sheet pan and laid all our bacon. Do a thumbnail, Mark. Ooh! <laughs> oh, I can't believe it! <laughs> <laughs> So I'm gonna stick this in the oven, and can you just explain really quickly, like how we like actually cook the bacon? So by, and Eddie Kim Woo Young knows this because I saw on Discord that he also did it himself. But, but I'm just gonna say that we copied him, which we didn't because we already filmed the other video. Sorry. We've done this for years too. Yeah. But anyways, if you don't know, and if you're um haven't been blessed like Kim Woo Young who had discovered this too. Cooking all the baking at once on one baking sheet not only is saves you time, but it's less messier. It's like you don't have to clean up the splatter all over your stove top when you your oven just gets most of it. And we don't here's a fact we don't clean our ovens every day, so it's okay. No. Let the grease build up in there, and then once a year. Either hire the cleaners like what we did. Oh my god, they did a, such a good job with our oven, by the way. We thought, no, we literally thought they took the oven out and put it in. It, <laughs> it was so clean inside. Or um, we have this, but we never used it because I was always afraid. But the um the self-cleaning feature in oven. Isn't that the one where it like basically feels like your house is gonna burn down because it's like, so it's high the heat? Highest heat, and then what it does is all the leftover like stuff in the oven, it gets so hot, it just literally 
like just elaborates. Elaborate? Elaborate? No, deliberate, elaborate, obliterate, obliviate. Oh, obliviate. Obliviate. Yeah. Yeah. That one took a while to get to, but we got there, girl. We got oh, there. Uh, people are confirming that we hit our 50 like goal. Oh, awesome. Let's do that first before we start marinating the shrimp. Um, let's see. I click on this one. What were some of the new ones that we should be like promoting? We have, so we have. Um, Oh, so Mark added an X, a ZYX challenge. You have mm -hmm. to find out. He added wear underwear on your head. Mm -hmm. And I think there were two that related to eating something very spicy, oh, which I... a jalapeno? A whole jalapeno? I'm just going to make you eat three-fourths of that. I only contribute a fourth. No one said that. Like, You never said like half-half. No, I thought like one or the other. People choose. <laughs> no, no, they're gonna. Good. Okay. Or no, ha, no, ha, no. Ha, ha, no, we. Fair. I thought I. The way you framed the other one, the other thing, I thought it was like a team thing. Like so, we just lean on each other to like complete it. Okay. Okay. We'll figure Fine, it out. Fine. Teamwork. It's all about. Um, it's a season of giving. <laughs> and of course, the subscriber giveaway. So you guys keep giving that like button, love throughout the stream, okay. and we'll spend more. Google. Google knows that we are a gay couple, so the ad they chose for this brow, this web page is it looks like a couple. Well, not anymore, but it was a same-sex couple for health insurance. Oh, maybe it knows to congratulate Tom and Sean slash Eddie. That's a stretch. That should be on their devices, not ours. <laughs> but they're on, but they're watching us right now, so it's like a oh, for them that's like, through us. That's scary. It's already scary that they could target ads, but to target people who are watching oh, you, my that's gosh. next level. Anyways, okay, we'll spin that. Let's spin that wheel. Okay, ready. Nice one to start, which I don't know what dessert we have, but we'll have dessert. Well, we're, we're just going to have to have dessert. Oh, yeah. yes. We actually have um, baked goods. Yeah. We also have the angel poop and the uh, toffee um, brittle, too. Yes. We have a lot of choices, actually. All right. So we're going to get to marinating our shrimp because... And the good thing about shrimp is you don't have to like wait too long for it to like actually marinate. There's other things like what chicken and other types of meat that you have to do a little bit longer. And here's the thing, like normally when we do mukbangs or we cook shrimp, we like to buy the big shrimp, almost like lobster sized shrimp. Right? Mm -hmm. But um, because these were on skewers, like it could, one could consider this as one large shrimp. Oh yeah. Yeah, for sure. Right. Because we're cooking it together. Yeah. All right. So let me make myself some room. We're going to do some olive oil to start out with. Oh, do you need me to lift some up? You know, I was going to grab, I have a glove. Oh, so I was going to just oh, rub yeah, it in yeah, after. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, that yeah. way you don't have to even, you can relax, enjoy your wine. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh, this spout is interesting. What's so funny? Because I saw you moving it before any of the oil came out. Oh, okay. Okay, so we're gonna gen we gave it some generous olive oil on there. We're gonna, of course, add some salt. Uh, Teresa, we'll be sure to show you the raw grit. Don't Absolutely. we have an open grit somewhere? In the uh, those ended up. Yeah, we tossed it after you got this new one. Do you need a? Oh, because you're going to... I'm going to... I'm going to... Yeah, so as long as I get the top layer pretty well, I'll make sure to get nice and... And I don't know how shrimp became like a perfect complement to grits, but it is very common, I would say, yeah, as yeah. a protein, right? Yeah, that's so interesting. Yeah. Oh, Steph, thank you so much. Just watched your COVID date night video and loved it. Yeah, we had a lot of fun with that one because it was just kind of totally outside of like what we normally do in terms of filming in terms of filming yeah i mean obviously we eat cook and stuff but yeah like well, obviously we eat at home <laughs> <laughs> no this James is a problem this isn't James, real james might cook it no filming filming all right so we got that i'm gonna squeeze some lemon make sure i don't get any on you 
getting all over my hands though. I got a little kitchen rag over here. I feel very prepared today. Garlic. I was getting to it. And I, and this, make sure I don't, oh, I already did that. I feel like I'll add a little bit of uh, parsley just for color, right? Oh gosh, this smells like a lot of, no? <laughs> you know, like when you open these garlic containers, sometimes you get like a good like whiff of it. You just do like. And if you want to have more garlic, you can even add some minced garlic with the grits. Yeah. If you want to. All right. Uh, the choice okay. is yours. No, I'm just going to add a little bit of parsley or color. And then obviously we'll, we have some extra for garnish. And I'm going to let you take over the chat because now I'm like in the zone. Make sure I don't miss anybody. Uh, Tommy, that was Old Bay seasoning. Um, so we did, again, we did olive oil, salt, pepper, Old Bay seasoning, minced garlic, parsley. Um, do you want some paprika or do you want more Old Bay seasoning? With that? I'll probably end up doing a little bit more Old Bay. Okay. Is, isn't the red in Old Bay some paprika or is that cayenne? I think it's like cayenne chili powder Got maybe, it. but um, paprika gives it a smoky flavor. But not only that, I think for me, why we should use paprika sometimes is for the color. Yeah. It just makes food look like it's been. Girl, let's get it then. I'm down. Yeah. Can you grab it? Oh, yeah. I feel like a shrimp fell off. Uh-oh, it did. It should be part of the, you know, we're going to need a Marie Kondo or spice rack. Spices are just one of those things where it's like, oh, wow, this is going to last till 2022. And then you blink and then it's 2022. Or no, it's 2023. Let's be real. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, shower this with a little bit of color. Yeah, we can add more old, old bait too. Yeah. This one is not cooperating. There we go. Tap, 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 tap. <laughs> Ooh, it smells like that. Um, what's that one thing? Lafroig. It has that same oh, smoky, like smoky smell. Yeah. Have you guys had Lafroig before? Um, Sean says, can one of the wheel wedges be getting slapped in the face with a marinated raw shrimp skewer? That sounds, I would veto that because I have a, I have a phobia of getting stabbed and that could get, like poke me in the eye or something. And I have a phobia of things on my face. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. And then, um, add, here, let's add a little bit more old base seasoning. Yeah. Get an assist. Let me know what side needs this. And again, we got this small because the last, last one, one we bought was probably like this size. And then yeah. we still had so much and it already kind of expired. Um, so might as well keep things fresh, you know? So even though probably the bigger container is cheaper, yeah. but it, it becomes mute because we end up throwing it away. Yeah. So might as well... Spend a little bit more with the with the smaller one, so that we way we always have fresh seasoning. Mm -hmm. uh, Tom says, "How about kimchi slap?" I think we're gonna be doing that this week <laughs> with you two. That's if you don't know this already. That's the passage to from engagement to marriage. Is you <laughs> have to go through a kimchi slap. Okay, don't be mad at me, but I think this one needs a little bit more. See stuff? Yeah. I just want to make sure there's like a little bit of red on each one. Each one. Yeah. Because some of them are like maybe and then maybe this last one before you go. Oh. Okay. That doesn't mean the bacon's ready. That just means it got to temperature. So you just need to check up on it. But that took a while if I think about it. I felt like you put you started the oven a while ago. 
Yeah. All right, so we're just gonna let these chill out here. Here's a close up of it. Can you guys see? Close enough. Mark's beautiful faces. Focus. There we go. You just let it sit for a little bit. Shrimp sashimi. <laughs> well, you know, there is a little bit of acid in there from the lemon, so maybe. All right, so we can kind of just hang out for a little bit because the grits will take about 15 to 20 minutes. We still need the bacon, so I guess we could start on the grits. Or is that too early? The thing is, you don't want to start on the grits too early because if you let it sit there long enough, then it just ends up clumping up. Hmm. So, oh, just drink a little bit more. How much butter are we using for both the grits and the shrimp? You know, I wasn't just planning like on, I was just going to one stick for both. Oh, for the grits. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Jane. Jane. Chef Jane. Boy or James. <laughs> Where's your hat and your mustache? I don't. I feel like I should wear a hat. My hair is very flat today. I should I might go get a hat. Is that okay? Oh, well, no. You could just um, already land on the wheel of wearing an underwear on your head. Do you mm -hmm. want to just do that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> No, wear, you a hat? wear your underwear on your head. We have to land on it. In fact, you want to just wear the. No, underwear not our underwear. existing underwear. I asked you specifically what the terms are, and you said it was a fresh pair. I just said wear your underwear. Yeah. Anyways, thank you, Jane. Oh, we got another. Um, Super sticker from Michaela. Bubba, we were gonna do the t-shirt on your head, but we changed it to t-shirt underwear on your head. I was gonna do the backwards cap, but I didn't feel cute doing that. Oh, how come? I don't know. Is this gonna cast a big shadow? Oh. No. No? That's good, fine. right? Okay. Michael, I am okay. If do I not look okay? <laughs> do we need to do something to acknowledge the super chats? Because we are we normally just yeah, let's drink, drink. Some plum wine. Yeah, oh, let's yeah, do some good of that. idea. Uh, any veggies? No, there's no veggies today. Green onion and parsley and jalapeno. <laughs> Sorry, I uh, thought about um, bell peppers, but didn't make the cut. Paprika, which I don't know what vegetables paprika. It comes from a vegetable? No. What do you think it is? It has to come from something. Oh, I don't know. Do you know what paprika is from? Do you know the paprika man, the paprika <laughs> man, the paprika man? Okay. Mm. Are these supposed to be uh, consumed like a shot? Sure. Oh, it's really sweet. You could drink it. You could sip on it. You could take a shot. Yeah. So, put some old day seasoning on here. Oh no. no. Mm. Um. Yes, yeah, Michael hair? and uh, Josephine and Hannah. You all know it is from red bell pepper. It is? I didn't know that. Oh my god, I would have gotten that wrong if I like um here's a here's a tidbit. Hmm. Korean people call bell peppers. Bell peppers is paprika. Really? Yeah. Well how do you say paprika then? They don't use paprika. <laughs> or they oh they don't no, they use um the other thing. Kadu. No, they'll use they actually just use culture oh, There's use no kochikadu. such thing as paprika in Korean cooking, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is getting ready. I think I can probably crank up. So we actually have a uh, pot of water like that's semi like heating up, but I probably should turn that up a little bit in a minute. Mm. I'll go check on the bacon real quick though, because I don't want to make. I want to make sure those don't burn. Yeah, we don't actually know how many minutes, James. We just eyeball it. Oh, it's it still has a ways to go. Oh, so okay. Yeah. So I'm gonna turn this up. More so that by the time I get there, it'll be like... but it's kind of already like boiling almost, huh? 
A little bit. Let's uh let's make some room then. Oh make some room. Yeah. I can do it. Bloop, bloop, bloop. It makes sense to um make the grits first before cooking the shrimp, right? No. So cook the shrimp first? I I mean I mean I that's a hard question because I would want the shrimp to be marinated for about like 20 minutes. Yeah, let's let it sit for a little bit longer. Um, but I mean it doesn't have to it doesn't have to be fresh off the Well, ground. I guess since grits takes 20 minutes, that might be a good time. And then I might just bring it back there to keep it warm because I don't want it to like yeah. get all oh my god, this is heavy. Ooh. Oh hi Angelina Spicy. She saw the jalapeno and was like, I need to be here. <laughs> you got it? Yeah. We are using our hexi-clad, not sponsored pan once again. And what are we cooking now? You're right. I thought you said grits. Oh my gosh, you're making me all like confused. <laughs> I'm not making you confused. How about while I get that set up, someone did request seeing what the grits look like, right? Oh yeah, yeah. Let's okay. Uh raise of hands who who has this in your pantry right now? I'm Is covering it a pantry them. staple? Who has this in your pantry right now? Fortunately, we don't have the aerial camera set up, but by the time we finish, you guys will see what it looks like. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's kind of filled to the brim, so I don't know. I mean, do I put it on my hand and show it, or here? Maybe just a little bit, but how many cups do I need of the grits? One for four? Okay. That's it. They probably expand, so here. Let me, let me you want to scoop? I mean, we're going to need to scoop one out anyways. Like, they look, it just looks like white sand. Do you see that? Yeah. Yeah? Here, you'll get to see it being poured. Just one cup of this. Yeah. So kind of fine, not not big like oatmeal at all, or rice even. Okay. I'm gonna turn this on. And Chalaxon Jackson says, "Hi, I love your mukbangs, and I'm subscribed. Thank you so much. Thank you for subscribing. And if you are new to our stream." and have not answered these three questions. Let us know where you're from, what's your favorite food, and how did you find us? Yeah. I'll just put this aside for us. Need some more wine. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Me too. And this seems like a fancy way to pour wine. I like it actually. It looks very like kung fu ish. Yeah. Kung fu -y. Yeah, same with grits. The container will actually tell you how much water to grit ratio you need. But then after that, it's really, I don't know, maybe the water in your part of the world is different. So you might need to add a little bit more cheese, like you said. Or so it, after that, you kind of just play it by ear, is how I my best experience with grits has been. I would think we might need a little bit more water because we're adding cheese in. Oh, okay. We but we, I mean, we could eyeball it. Here's the butter. I think we're gonna add, I mean, technically we can add the whole thing. Is that a lot of butter? I think that's, a, I think it'll be okay, actually. Yeah. It all melts, right? So. Butter has no carbs. <laughs> And Jackson is from Nova Scotia, Canada. We got another Canadian in the house. All right, so I'm gonna pour this in now. Ooh. And again, I'm, I apologize, I forgot to do the other camera angle today. So we're just gonna have to use our imagination. 
quick stir. When we added uh, jalapeno last time, did we saute that first? No. We just went straight in? We okay. just went straight in. Uh, interesting. The, you could also microwave grits. Really? I've never yeah, done that's that what, before. That's what it says. Because I was yeah. curious if the stovetop was the only way. But no, it says microwave. Combine water, grits, and salt in two cup microwave safe bowl. Yeah. Wow. We do need to add some salt to this, though. So... good for now i'm gonna lower the heat because it's it's looking intense over here and you want to keep stirring especially like the bottom part because you don't want the bottom part to burn right right so um i feel like a witch like brewing my cauldron what are they even making in that or are they melting like little children which is brew oh we've had the voodoo one we had the voodoo brew. that one like can you imagine if we went on live and we drank that? Mm -mm. Maybe next Halloween we could do a witch's brew. That might be fun. And we drink from the cauldron. Halloween and their drinks have done a lot of damage on us. I know. <laughs> Halloween drinks? I don't know about that. Yeah. And we have definitely had gumbo, Salvi. Actually, Mark really likes gumbo. Gumbo and jambalaya. I really yeah. like him. Yeah. This is kind of relaxing. You know what? Pouring the grits into the bowl felt like some kind of like sand ceremony, like for a wedding. Like it just felt like nice. <gasps> they should make grits in an hourglass. That's the packaging. And then what? And you cook from there? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and no, it's 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 the packaging is in the so the packaging is an hourglass, but the amount you pour. Uh -huh. You flip it back to tell you how long it needs to cook. Oh my God, I should go on Shark Tank. Would you guys invest in me? No? <laughs> Matthew Edwards, thank you for the love. It kind of, it thickens up, kind of like a um, porridge. Yeah, or for sure. A pottage, <laughs> which I don't know what a pottage is, but. And Bowman, thank you so much. I looked up grits. Looks like a nice thing to make. And cheers. Uh, Desiree, you know what? After this stream, we will probably decide what our Christmas menu will look like. And as far as I know, I think we're still live streaming on Friday. But if some for some reason that changes, we'll uh, just follow us on Discord, Instagram, and what's the other third thing? Where? YouTube. <laughs> and we'll let you know. Sorry. Getting a little feisty. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Is it too early to add the jalapenos? No, let's add it in. Let's add that in. And maybe with the butter. So this is a whole jalapeno. We did not take out. <gasps> what if the jalapenos are hot? Well, we won't know until after. We won't know. So that a good idea? Oh gosh, whatever. I was gonna take it back. We don't wanna waste food here. Goat and Gouda says, hi gentlemen, hi fellow chatters, welcome. Yeah, if you guys are having, you know, how are you, how are you celebrating the holidays? What are you doing for your holiday dinner or Christmas dinner? And, you know, it seems like Eddie and Julie are going back and forth about uh, Korean idol groups. Speaking of which, Mark's favorite singer is releasing a song at like one or two in the morning here. So he's super can't wait. excited. And we did leave the seeds, Michael. Are you afraid that's, of the seeds? That's my rule. Cause, so usually when I prep and chop the jalapenos, I always add the ribbon seeds of a jalapeno in the food. Yeah. I don't even like James though, but... But he's like, oh, I want to chop the jalapenos today. I was like, okay. So he took out the gloves and he uh, started chopping. And he's like, wait, do I take the seeds out? I was like, no. But so, but it's okay if you do, though. Yeah. I just I just love the seeds of jalapenos in, in the food. Because if not, then you're just eating, like, just green onions. Right. Like, what's the point of adding jalapenos? 
Make a mental note uh, in the Discord. Let's drop your favorite artist's uh, oh, music yeah. video for Julie. Julie says, who's Mark's fave? So we'll tell you more. She's described as the Korean Madonna, if you guys didn't know. Um, bonus five points if anybody in the chat can spell her name and <laughs> identify her. Uh, Paul's having lechon for Christmas. Oh, of course, Angelina would say seeds. Of course. Of course. Okay, I'm going to add the butter now. It's too early. Let's add a little half, bit half. And then we'll finish it off with the other half at the very end mm. to make it extra creamy, you know? Yeah, right. Okay, with the whole chunk in? Sure. It'll melt. Yeah, yeah it'll melt. Peter, welcome to our stream. And Jenny is having prime ribs, scalloped potatoes, and maybe a Caesar salad and sourdough rolls. Ooh, yes. that was, that's a very um, complete meal. Yeah. I feel like how, or Christmas came early for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we got to spin the wheel again. Thank you, Josephine. She's been on it. She's been telling us exactly what oh, we we're doing. Oh, we love that. Yes. Because here's the thing um, I, you don't know this, but we, we use another platform to stream. So we don't even get to see YouTube. Mm -mm. We don't even know how many likes we have. No, we don't. So so we rely on you to let us know. So, Justin, thank you for keeping us on track. All right, you All right, ready? Let's spin that wheel. I did 11 seconds this week. Oh my gosh. Uh, oh oh my gosh. gosh. Oh, that was, close. that was close. That was close. Okay, so what this is, is within 30 seconds, James and I will is work. Is that even physically possible? Fine. Or 45 mentally? seconds? 45 seconds, yeah. So within 45 seconds, James and I will work as a team, as a team to try to say the alphabet backwards within 45 seconds. And if we don't get it in time, we take then we take a shot. I already feel not good about this. Do you want me to set her? Yes. And let me just turn this off because okay, yeah. I, I want to I want to You want to concentrate? Okay. So I'm going to turn off the You try to do now. it at home and if, if be honest, let us know if you're successful, but I don't I have no confidence right now. I can't even Okay. Okay, so you, who's going first though? So we know who's like, No, who's we go see? together. Oh, we're not alternating? I thought that's how it worked. Oh, we could, Oh, okay, we call. Was that harder? No, we work together as a team is what you're saying. Yeah. Okay. Well, no, we no, could no, alternate. No, no, no. Oh, no. Like together is probably okay, better. Right? Okay. All right. Alexa, set timer for 45 seconds. 45 seconds, starting now. Z-Y-X-W-V-U-T-S-R-Q-Q-P-O-M-M-L-K-K-L. No, no, K. K. J. J. H. I don't H, know. J, H. J. No, it's not H. J. J I, G, I, H. I. H. I. J. So I. H. G. F. 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 E. E. D. C. B. A. Did we do it though? No. Did we do it though? Did we get it right? Oh my god. Okay, wait. Can right someone now, confirm? Okay, the time just went off. Right Alexa now. off. Why would that sobered me up? That straight up sobered me up. I'm no. That it really got hard at the L M N O P part and the J, like the G H I J K. Oh my god. We got it. Oh well, nice. Yes. That was hard. That I was felt hard. like you did all the work. And like literally when he would say like a letter, I would say it like a second later. <laughs> no, sometimes I guess and then like, but I, I did stop confirm. you when I knew it wasn't right. Yeah. Because I was like, that doesn't sound right. Yeah. Oh my God. I feel like we should just drink for that anyways. I need a drink after that. Okay, we'll pour a shot. But should we add the cheese? This is this is like thick already. Oh yeah. Right? Is there a way to show them like the ooh, like lift and then just kind of does that look sexy? Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> so I got a bag of, I like to use sharp cheddar because you want to make sure you know that there's cheese in here. Okay. And then don't mind my mixing. I just want to make sure the bottom of the pot is not burning. So that's why if you do constant mixing, you make sure that it's not going to burn. 
Oh, I have to check on the bacon. Oh, Ooh, I smell I bacon. I can smell it. And I need to open this thing. Oh, it looks no, good. Just turn it off. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, uh, Josephine reminded us we need to change our goal, like goal. Oh, thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So the other week when Josephine was saying her husband was playing uh, Cyberpunk, I didn't know that game at all, and then all of a sudden I heard so much, so much news about it. So I guess really? it's a new game, but it has a lot of glitches. <laughs> I'm gonna add half the bag to start. Okay, and then we'll mix that in. I was supposed to do a taste test to make sure it was good. This is just the same as like, you know, when you smell wine, you gotta make sure the cheese is good. Oh, when you smell, when you actually have to smell the cork. Mm-hmm. Mm, -hmm. mm it's good. Mm. Oh, the color already looks, I don't know if you could tell, but the color already looks good. Let's add more cheese, might as well. Um, spoiler alert, we have another bag in the fridge, but I don't think we need two. That's like, that's excessive. At that point, it'll be just, it'll cheese. be cheese and grits. Because there's more cheese than grits. Like uh, grits, is not, grits is like an afterthought. Okay. <laughs> so let's put this off to the side because we want to cook the shrimp, right? Yes. Okay. Um, so we'll heat this back up and add the rest of the butter. We might want to add more cheese. We'll see. Let me put this on our bowl. Uh, can you use this temporarily? Sure. Oh, it looks good. Oh, it looks really beautiful. I want to taste test a bit later. <laughs> And then we'll put the lid on there. Um, we, you wanted a drink, a shot? I'll do whatever you tell me at this point. I, well, technically, we oh, we, we, we got the game. I just said we, we needed got a drink the Z Y X W. Okay, next week we might have to do it in thirty seconds or something. Okay. Now, see, the question I have about this is, since it's marinated in olive oil, do we need to put more olive oil, or? I would use a little bit more. Just a smidge? Yeah, might as well. Also, it comes out of both spots. It depends on how you twist it. Oh, it doesn't? This hole is just to help. The small hole is to help aerate the spout uh, so that it comes out of the spout. OK, that's good. And we're at 101 likes. Already? Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, Thank you for all that love. Dish. Ready? We're going to spin that wheel. Are they getting removed as we go? They are, right? I think so. Mm. Eat a whole Thai pepper. Okay. And then we, then we bring Is that it out per person or just. Uh, is Thai chili pepper going to be good with this? <laughs> that was uh, that was Mark's doing, guys. Um, real quick in the chat, forward cap, backwards cap, I will take the first three answers. We're going to let this heat up. Pick, pick similar size uh, peppers, please. Oh, they were so spicy last time. I'm glad I wore a hat. That means all of my um I do some I can't tell. Good enough. Oh my god, because they're frozen, they kind of feel like uh what you would call it? Like fake. They're so hard. They feel like plastic. Yeah. I got uh, <laughs> back, forward, forward, back, 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 forward and forward. Okay, I got I got more back, so I have to do it back. Back, back, foot and foot. Oh, but it don't look cute right now. Fix it for me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Baby, I'm married to you. You know what? It's almost Christmas is actually our engagement anniversary. Oh, you're right. Yeah. But we don't actually celebrate that because it's Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Claudia, welcome. Okay, and I got my tongs here. We're gonna be cooking our shrimp. For our shrimp and grits. Just carry it, just hold it from the stick. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna need these. Yeah, yeah, right. you're gonna need this to flip it, but. Yeah. 
You know our next, oh, sorry, that one came off. Our next home, we need to have one of those kitchen islands where there's actually a vent right above. That'd be nice, based off of what we do here. So we build another vent hood above the kitchen. Oh, but then it would make too much noise, huh? There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go again. What's my mi what's what's that phone call? Oh, let's drink that. Oh, you're so fair. You just so mad. When it comes to drinking, you're very fair, which is not good for the rest of us. This is kind of making me miss soju. It's too sweet. I know, but it's, but it's good. good for you. What what health benefits are there? Do tell. Plum is good for your digest, like fermented plum. Girl, I do not have any issues. Oh. I you know how many times, but I did James have had his leftover Alfredo. I know. Today. I think I'm lactose, and I'm not happy, and I'm in denial about it. I need your guys' support. What do I do? Just it, like embrace the fact. What do you? I kind of that lone shrimp. I kind of want to. No, leave it there. I left it there for K. Mu Young, oh. so that he's like, it's not perfect. Look, show him. Look, there's a shrimp that's not on a skewer. You can't even see it. I'm that girl. I came for blood tonight. I feel like it's Friday because it is a shorter week. Oh no, Michael says be forewarned that the above head bent over an island has pointy corners that my head seems attracted to. Oh my gosh. That who's attracted to? Mike? Yeah, my, Michael's head is attracted oh. to the those corners of the... Yeah. Sean says, you just take the risk and make sure there's a toilet nearby. Sean, I will text you something later and I will tell you in deep. It's, we're not playing truth or drink today, but I will tell you after. Yes. Yes, runaway pancake. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go again, girl. What's my weakness, man? That's that one song. It's salt and pepper, I think. Ebony made chicken and steak for heater tonight. That sounds delicious. Okay, I set the set the air. Oh, just being you're so sweet. I love your marriage and how fun you guys are. We try. We try. Ruth, we are making shrimp and grits. And Hannah, the bacon is still in the oven. Do you need this? Is that or you got it? I got it. Thank you. Oh, it's that one song. Shoo, shoo, the do, shoo, the do. What is that the one? It's like I'm so crazy. I'm gonna have your baby. I'm so crazy. I'm gonna have your baby. Shoot, shoot. I think it is that one. Yeah. 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 Like. She yeah, doesn't do declarative then, though. I think she's. I think I'm gonna have your baby. And then, or like that, um, Seven Eleven. No, that's a different song. I think. What? He got me open like Seven yeah. Eleven and yeah. the oh, that's, that's, a a song. Song. that's the. I think that's. Oh wait, that's what a man. Oh yeah. Then the crazy. I'm gonna have your baby. Might be a water. What a man. <laughs> Oh, the shrimp looks really good. Can you guys see that? It smells really smells good. good. Too. You know, Tom, I don't think that's that strange, but he says pineapple between the shrimp might be good to serve with the bread. Yeah. True that. It's a very uh, Caribbean or Caribbean. How do yeah. you say it? Caribbean. Caribbean or Caribbean? I say Caribbean. But, but that's like buffet or buffet. I never say buffet. I'm going to the buffet. Buffet is Phoebe's last name. Julie, uh, we'll tell you in the Discord, but his, her name's Um Jung Hwa. And then her digital single's coming out 6 p.m. December 22nd, Korea time, so in California time, it will be 1 a.m. today? I have, I have a theory, so she's been, and full on leopard print for her like teaser concept. I feel like one of her dance moves is gonna be like her pulling on a high ponytail. Well, she has a lot of images where she's pulling on her high ponytail. Well, there you go. That's why I said that. 
Uh, Hannah, I don't think have we bought anything on sale since Black Friday. I don't think so. I don't know if we bought yeah. things on sale, but we bought things. Yeah. Thank you, Paul. And Island Candy says tonight I'm making a ton of cookies, brownies, cookie bars, rum balls just to start. Ooh, Ooh we need to get on the yeah. the ball the ball trend where they like mold the ball and then you put oh, hot water and then I I think I've seen that before. Yeah, yeah. it's like a TikTok thing. I Lala's world and I, should I remove this comment from Eddie? He said Lee Jung Hyun, greater sign, greater sign, greater sign, greater sign. Um, Jung Hwa. Do we ban him? But wait, what is she doing now? She's she, okay. she went like this and then she just disappeared. She's actually doing a lot more like acting, cooking. Uh, yeah, acting, see, by cooking, like so she looks like a housewife. So I'm yeah. like, yeah, who is well, she? Who, who, is this? who are you that? I don't know her. Hi, hey, well, lol. <laughs> what about sweaty balls? <laughs> it's winter time, and the sweaty balls are still here. It's it's been it's still warm. Really warm here in California. Really warm. Mark said it's La Nina right now. La Nina. Yeah. So for us, La Nina in California, we will experience more. Uh, a drier Dry. and warmer winter than usual. Mm -hmm. Um, is Sister Slam Dunk the unnies? Is that what Sister Slam Dunk is? Someone asked, "Who's your favorite girl from?" Nah, 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 nah. Like Tiffany from the no, first no, one, no, no, and then no. Somi in the second one. Who's the one that I always confuse Taknade with? Oh, the other comedian? Yeah. I don't know her name. It's like, there, why is there two comedians that have the same short bob hair that likes to wear hats and very outrageous clothes? It's confusing. It's like Zoe Dachanel and the other girl that they always confuse her with. I just don't get it. Oh, I, I used to get, um, run, 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 I thought you were going to say the run, so I was like, girl, we ain't playing Rhino, 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 and it's so cute. Give me a I'll tell you her name. Right. Why Nona? Uh huh. Ryder. Uh -huh. And no, not plural. Ryder. And what's I forgot the other girl's name. Um, the one from Who the Boss. Who the Boss? <laughs> <laughs> Who the Boss? Have you guys watched Who the Boss? Oh, Alyssa, Alyssa Milano. Oh, yes, yes. Don't they kind of look alike? Or so no? let me repeat what Mark just said. He gets Winona Ryder and Alyssa Milano confused. There you go. And also, as a kid, I used to get um, oh, Penelope Cruz. And Salma Hayek. And Salma Hayek. Mm. Kind of confused. Yeah, I can see that. Who's taller? I think Mark because of his hair, but not any other reason. We're very similar in height. Yeah. Sometimes if I stand this way, I look taller. Sometimes James stands the way he looks taller in photos. But we're both, according to our driver licenses, uh, yeah, we're both They're the same, right? Well, yeah. What's on your driver license? Five eight or five seven? Seven. I think I lied. It was five eight. Girl, I'm taller than you. Hashtag revolution. I'm, I need a drink for that. Yeah, wait. Should I put the shrimp on another plate? Uh, we do need, oh, actually, we could just put it on the pan. But I think we're doing the grits first, and we need to add more butter, and if you want more cheese. No, no, I mean, like, we, we don't need to remove the pan. We could just put it on a pack, what are these called? Hatching? Yeah. Is it okay over here? Or is that too? Yeah. And then I'm bringing the grits back? Sure. And then what are we doing with the bacon? Are we cooking the bacon? I mean, cutting the bacon? <laughs> yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to crumble them. I might have to do it off camera, guys, because there's no room here. If someone wants to super chat us so we can buy a bigger island, please do. Yeah. Oh, I think, so I'm probably just gonna put the tongs. Like I cooked the whole package of bacon, but you don't necessarily need to use all the bacon. I think a few. Oh, uh, let's do it. Quick taste test. Do five pieces of bacon 
guys. That's how many I'm feeling like today. I'm going to add a little bit more salt. <laughs> and then I think a little bit more cheese will give it enough. Well, now we have the bacon in this bag that I'm going to crumble. Oh, through the bag. I don't know if that's a good tip. Interesting concept. It's a hack. You know, this is Food Network. It's hot, though, so I ain't going to touch it yet. Interesting concept. I ain't going to touch it yet. It's too hot to touch. Okay. Hi, Joshua. Happy Monday. I mean, Thank you for saying happy Monday. I forgot it was Monday. Yeah, it feels like a Friday, actually. And then do you see the is, – is, can you see the jalapeno oh, yes. pieces? That makes – to me, the whole, the green bits of jalapeno makes my mouth water for grits. Yeah. Like it needs to have that for it to look good for me at least. Is that a little bit more cheese? Okay, wait, I have to check if the cheese is still good. It's been open for a little bit. Mm, still good. Okay. You always have to be careful when you're gonna add something that's salty. You kind of have to like taste, hold taste, back on the salt because if you're yeah. adding something salty, you might get too salty. Taste as you go. Taste as you go. Oh my god, that sounds amazing! Island candies, can you just make that for us? A Where salmon Wellington. Oh. <laughs> Kasha's says, "Kamu Young, I knew you were a fine tall man. He is a tall glass of milk." Is a tall glass of tall dirty glass of milk. Dirty glass? Is there olive was, juice in him? That'll gonna, curdle. I was gonna say a tall glass of dirty milk, but that wouldn't make sense. It's a tall, dirty glass of milk. Dirty glass of milk. You know milk. that little boy wearing the cowboy hat and he thinks it's all tough, so he walks into a saloon and then goes to the bar and the bartender's like, Well, what do you want? And he the little boy trying to be all tough is like I have a milk in a dirty glass. Oh, that's what you. Yeah, I know what you're talking about now. <laughs> I don't know if it's doing anything. <laughs> this is a. This is called a Pinterest fail. I probably should just use scissors and cut, cut, cut. No, it's it's working. It's kind of crumbly. It's really crumbly. Oh, good, good, good. You just can't use a kitchen towel over it. I have very sensitive not hands. Good grip. I have sensitive hands. Girl, do not tell everyone about my poor grip. I think I grip just fine. Any complaints? Okay. Um, before you add the topping. Oh, we're not gonna we add it. We're gonna transfer it to the book. That 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 nicely one. Is that? Did you taste test? Taste test. Test it. You didn't taste test? Just it? a little bit, yeah. Is it good? Yeah, it's really good. Mmm. Yeah. And then it's when spicy. We, when we plate it, I want to add a little Another bit of butter on cheese. Top. Oh, a little bit of butter. And we can add more cheese on top. Wait, of like how do I need to do anything with the butter? Do I need to start? A little dollop do of, okay, so of it. What I need to do now is to help transfer this first. Let me grab the. Oh, we both can't be off camera, girl. They're gonna. Oh, we don't do the bowl. Oh, why? Oh, okay. Oh, but I have to put the other small plate down first. Yeah. You don't need to wear gloves for that plate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous. I don't like to burn. Okay, wait. So you're gonna lift that. Are you in frame? Yeah, my hand, my big old arm is still there. And guys, look. Don't ask us where we got this, but Mark got this recently. Look at how gorgeous this is. We can move this back a little bit, actually. <gasps> we have to eat Thai chili peppers still. Oh, and we might have to spin more wheel. Well, we got this to make some grilled, how nice this grilled, is. Um, grilled kimchi and pork belly on here. But James saw this is like, can I use it as a plate? I was like, okay. So, but I we were saving it to do our a grilled kimchi. Pork yeah. Pork and I'm just pouring this. Yeah, just pour it, girl. I'll pour it this way for dramatic thumbnail face. Do you need? To do oh. Oh my, what? Oh, it's what all over my glove. That? Oh no, why? We need to wash it then. Sorry. I need... might need your help to like scoop up. Okay. Sorry. Can you tilt it more? 
center, center, so it evenly pours up in the center of the plate. Don't rotate your arms oh. up more. Yeah. Okay, okay. Sean says this looks like Hangul Korean Korean character, Korean character, Korean character times. What does that mean? Okay, I'm gonna move this. Okay. Careful. Oh, yeah. Tilt it up, tilt it up. Yeah. There we go. Oh, it's barely on the gloves. So I'm being dramatic. Pat, pat, booty, booty, pat, pat. Is that booty, what he's saying? Booty. I don't know. I didn't see it. This, it already went scrolled up. Guys, talk a little slower. Okay, now what? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we already oh. did a lot of butter, but we might as well do Just more. a little dollop here and there. And then maybe another small layer of cheese on top. Okay. Did that dollop of butter melt? Maybe even a little bit of color. And, ooh. <laughs> what happened? Smell this. <laughs> it's, it literally smells like someone ate bacon all day and farted. I'm so sorry. Because <laughs> the Ziploc bag was enclosed. Girl. <laughs> Oh, I'm doing that thing where when I smell something I like, but don't like. Okay, so I'm going to sprinkle some bacon on top. Yeah. Oh, so I'll let you do that first. Let's you do that. Do some green onions. That might be enough. I don't have too much. Right? Yeah. Here, I'm going to use the jalapeno as a spoon to kind of spread the bacon apart. <gasps> oh, my God. Look how pretty it's this pretty. is. It's pretty. I'm going to take a picture soon. Oh, and then the skewers. I feel like we kind of don't need the skewers, huh? Yeah, I'll I'll give a close up of you guys in a moment. How should we, how should we do the skewers? Just on top? Yeah, I think just okay. I'll yeah. do maybe four. Four, and then I'm gonna do one of these crisscross seeds. <gasps> oh, yeah. Hold on. Oh, diagonal, diagonal. Did you already do parsley? No. We'll Last parsley at the very end. Is there anything else before I continue? No. Okay, parsley. Parsley. Parsley that ish. <gasps> Guys, where else on the internet can you find this? Now, is this am ambitious? Does that look good or what? Tell me. I'm going to hold it here for 10 seconds. 10. You guys just join, hit that like button, subscribe. We don't mess around on this channel. We're gonna eat it right away. I need a paper. Oh, I need a paper towel. Here you go. Boo. And I want to take a picture real quick. Oh yeah, because it's so beautiful. Take a picture. Um, Which angle? You this, you always know this angle. Blends here. This way. This way. Okay. Oh, it's on selfie mode. Oh my god, it looks it looks gorgeous. How do we make I'm surprised? And we still have our Thai chili pepper. Girl, I'm not looking forward to that though. If you guys want to see this picture, sign up to our Discord. It's in our chat. Do it after the stream. <gasps> okay, time to eat. So much fun. Okay. Oh, Thai chili pepper. Move the butter. We still have wine. I'm just gonna. Use, yeah, we don't need any more garnishes, no, right? So I'm, I'm just gonna, re, gonna <laughs> reuse the plate that we use for this green onions. Okay. All right. Let's try some grit with a little bit of bacon first. Yeah. Mm. Oh, oh! The bacon is the perfect. It's crunchy. Topping because grit, no texture. Grits, grits, no texture, but the grits mm. is so creamy and cheesy with the cheddar cheese, and has a little kick to it from the jalapenos. But that bacon gives it that texture that you need. Yeah. Right? Oh my god, it's good. Mm, we hit the like goal. We will get to that after we finish eating. Do you guys keep mm. hitting that like goal for us? I'll change it to 150. We owe you guys at least one spin. 
and we're just loving all the likes tonight. Thank mm. you so much for hitting that like goal. And Josephine and our mods and other people confirming our likes and encouraging people to like our video. That means a lot to us. Mm. Yeah. yeah. That's good. It's good. Really, really good. Yeah. <laughs> How? Okay, let's try. I'm going to try a shrimp. Yeah, girl. get the shrimp, girl. And Marita, remember, Mark does not mind bacon as long as it's with food, right? Yeah. But if it's straight up bacon, like there's like a bunch of bacon over there, I'm I'm going to go to town with that, but he'll probably leave it Oh, alone. the shrimp is so good. Tinsa? Let's try. It's really good. You taste the garlic. Mmm. Mmm. It's so good. Oh, yeah. So good. We got a nice char on it. Yeah. Mmm. Thank you, Hexclad. Literally, that Old Bay seasoning goes a long way. Yeah. Mm. Wow, even adding all the jalapenos, it's not that spicy, so. No, where's our chili pepper? I have one here. Oh, no. I'm not ready. Are we ready? I might this? do it all in one, but that would ruin the rest of the meal, no? Then what do, do I do? A little bit of that. Okay, not bad. Oh, not bad. Oh, it's oh, there's a kick to this. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this oh, this one is picante. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I knew we should have done two jalapenos with the grits. But we landed on this. Guys, if you're wearing headphones right now, take them off. Ah, oh my God, it's so spicy. He's, this one, and we only ate the tip, but it has a, this one has a good kick. We got the, um, <laughs> wait, the, but the, the heat is kind of helping. Like, the mad one. It. What's the mad one? That's the mad one. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh. I need James as an alarm. <laughs> I'm available for services. You can just record my, uh, you know, voice over and over. It's drinking the wine. Is does wine help? Bubba says just the tip. Bubba, that's I didn't know that's what you like. Ah! How the freak am I supposed to eat the rest of this? No, no, no I'll eat it. Dude, we cannot, we, oh, wheel spin. What if it lands on the jalapeno? The jalapeno is not that, maybe it'll be, maybe it's paprika. <laughs> maybe it's not as spicy. <gasps> this pan is adorable. Where do you find all these things? <laughs> Wait, I don't want to take it. I'll finish it for you. No, that's a cop out. That wasn't your intention. Your intention was to make me suffer. And are you happy now? No, I'm suffering. This is this is called service to our viewers who actually like our video. This is what this. Who likes are, this? Who we likes this? To them. We owe them this. Sean, that's actually a really. I've never heard anyone like say that before. But he says the air raid scream like. This is probably You're what they do in North Korea when they alert people like something's happening. Ah! Like, wouldn't that? You're gonna re-trigger people okay, who I'm grew sorry. up in the 50s that actually have to. I know, no, 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 no. That's not my intention. So you need to drop it when I say don't do that. It's not even offensive. Why are you so? Why are you so weird? No, right? I don't want you to say that. I'm a... triggering anybody. That's offensive. Me just sitting here could trigger a lot of people. Us why? Gay, why are you sitting people. here? I'm just, no, I'm just saying we can't control what triggers people. But what I'm oh, saying yeah. is I'm stating historical facts that during the beginning of the Cold War. Bro, I don't the, even know what year that was. Do what, you? Yes. Well, oh, 1800? <laughs> of the Cold War. It was, in, oh, it was it a colder? No. 19. Was, yeah. But 19, it was, but before, it was after Titanic, but before Civil War. Wait, Civil War is no, 18. <laughs> after Civil War and after Titanic. How about that? Um, technically, it's after another world significant event. Jesus being born? The Cold War, which is the, like, the race for, like, 
super world power between America and Russia, which is the two super power back then. With, hey, let me ask you guys this question. With, who do you think watches History Channel and who do you think watches E? <laughs> you ask me about any of the Kardashians, I will tell you. You ask Mark about any of the wars, he'll tell you. Okay, it went away, but now I have to like redo it, and I'm not about that. Do you want pork or your shrimp? Does, is our spoon working? Oh yeah, it's working. Mm -mm. <gasps> oh my god, that hit like a nostril. Did you take a bite? Oh yeah, you did. Eat grit. Eat grit, 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 grit. Girl, that's a huge. Eat the leftover cheese. That'll help. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Can I make that noise? I kind of like that noise. Woo! <laughs> you make noises. Some scientists might come rush over thinking that the extinct animal came back to life. No, oh yeah. The long last, like, dodo bird came back to, like, where is the sound coming from? Oh, I'm glad you said dodo bird and not, like, mammoth or something large. I mean, dodo bird is not all that of a compliment either. <laughs> Excuse me! It's a dodo bird. Do you know why they were called dodo birds? They're cute, right? They're super cute, but the people who <laughs> named them that thought they weren't smart birds. Ice so cream? So that's where the dodo brain comes from. So you think I have a dodo brain? No, I'm just saying... Giving you some information tidbits. How do I make this not hot? You said cheese? Cheese, what? Maybe some bacon, I don't know. Oh, maybe the angel poop will help. The angel poop will definitely help. Oh, do you wanna take a shot of olive oil? That should help for sure. I've never done that except for that one time. What time? Oh my God. Temecula. Last year, I was filming for work, but I was so sick, I couldn't stop coughing. And what? then one of my staff member for the video gave me a shot of olive oil because she's like, this might help. So I was, I took a shot of olive oil. I still cough, but I think it, it helped. I guess, yeah. What it video really, though? The, really the work helped. one? The transitional housing one. It's, oh. It hasn't been published yet because we can't still grab it, but. You were sick. I was super, yeah, it was right before um, our New Orleans stuff. So. We have two more shrimp skewers, by the way. So, Natalie, we don't have milk in here. Don't be shy. Two more shrimp skewers? Yeah. The grits are, oh, the burning, like, is it's traveling. So, my outer, do you not feel a single thing when you eat spicy? No, I do. Like, what do you feel? Like, like my nose would start running. I still, I still <laughs> taste heat. So, I'm just dramatic, is what you're saying? Now you realize? <laughs> Maybe, no, really. I feel like, you don't understand what spicy is to me, and I don't understand what spicy is to you. It's so bizarre. It is. It's, <sighs> it's weird how the same human being could experience two different things. <sighs> you look normal. Like, nothing changed after eating that. Okay, I'm just going to get this one over with. We cannot land on the jalapeno thing. You guys, take away your thumbs up. <laughs> jalapeno potentially could be... Really, even spicier? It could be spicy, but the chances of it being spicy could be that it's not spicy at all. Okay, I'm gonna add my shrimp to my. Oh, that's beautiful. Grit, that that looks like together. a um. That looks like a wedding appetizer. Oh, on a spoon. Yeah. Sean and Tom, if you're still watching, maybe an idea. Yeah, should we cater for it? Fondue fountain. <laughs> Oh my god, all the seeds came out. What's up, Ty? We Ty! Were, we were supposed to hang out before when it got really dangerous to hang out. So we need to plan something when it gets better again soon. Oh, I didn't chew that pepper. That Ty went like right down. Ty or Ty? Both. It just hit the back of my throat and it's really spicy now. <gasps> I don't want to, I'd rather be an air raid than a dodo bird coming back from like, they're not extinct, right? They are extinct. <gasps> oh no. Yeah. Is it because they were stupid? Like, they can't, 
the the settlers killed all the dodo birds in South America. Oh, I got through that chili pepper better. Okay, oh, you're used to it then. No, you just swallow it whole. Don't let it linger. That's like life advice there, guys. I know it's not Friday night, but you know what I'm saying. And if you don't, then you're too young for this. Ah. Bubba says uh, the first time he had shrimp, they were breaded and didn't know they had tails. Which, by the way, oh, but that's okay. You could eat the tails. These have tails. Sometimes we don't eat them. Like here, we, we have them out. Sometimes I eat them. They're totally edible. I eat the tails um, when they're all fried, but I can't eat them if they're just sauteed. Can I get more wine? But even when it's sauteed, I still eat them because it it's has good for your really, fingernails. It well, yeah, really, it has. It's a high source of calcium, so yeah. it's like why they're away. Probably the most nutritious part of a shrimp. Um, have we ever been to a rave? Because Ty thinks that because of my outfit the other day, I'm ready for a rave. The one where I went like this and I had a mask on. I've never been to a rave. Have you? Like a fake rave. What's a fake? School. What's a fake rave? There's uh -huh. is there, there was, like lights a, still? Yeah, it was a party. Uh, back then, like those candy bracelets were really popular. Oh. Baggy jeans, like those plastic like beaded necklace, and they used to so I could stick around. But it wasn't a real rave. Should we do a rave live? Oh, and you, you like kind of spin glow sticks around. Yeah. I'll take share. I'm trying not to be dramatic, but I am, and I cannot change who I am. It's spicy. Physiologically, I am sweating right now. I am melting before yeah. your eyes. It's okay. It's it's good. I don't have to eat anymore, so I'm fine. Julie says, James, don't trust the fart after that pepper. You know what? Spicy food doesn't make me, like, questionable. Except for fire noodles. Oh, those, yeah. Not questionable, but you just have a bad aftermath. Oh, uh, Emerita, the air is on full blast. Thank you for the reminder. We still owe you guys a wheel spin. Keep hitting that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Maybe we'll be at 19.7 after this stream. We were at like 19.699 right oh, before. Oh, boy, we're so close. Yeah. Josephine says, honestly, James isn't being dramatic. People back in the day used to spice to deter people from eating a lot. People who enjoy spice are the ones that are weirder technically. So I'm skinny now? I was almost under my weight thing. I, I can't tell you the weight, but I was almost under. It's because I only ate half my dinner yesterday. Even though it was all carbs. It was all carbs. Well... You're judging me. No, we didn't. We didn't have lunch either yesterday. So, oh, we didn't. You're right. Yeah. I'm skinny now. Get that toilet brush ready, Mark. I don't even know what that is. Eddie, he calls it a toilet wand, and I'm like, it does work magic. No, we have those Clorox disposable ones. Oh, okay. There's no. Those are called wands. Those are called toilet wands. Mm. Yeah. Why well, am I thinking of Wanda Sykes all of a sudden? Wand, Wanda. Okay. Mm, we put a lot of cheese up in here. We added this whole bag. How much? There's still a little corner of it. It's fine. We added half a pound of cheese, cheddar cheese. So um, Strictly Dumpling in Korea, he's been drinking a lot of drinks that have cheese in it. What kind of cheese is that? Do you know? Strictly Dumpling, Mikey Chen or whatever? He's, just what? he's been drinking those desserts that oh. have cheese in it. It was, what kind it of cheese is that? Brown cheese? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, you don't I, want I, no brown cheese in I my dessert. I don't remember the name. It was called brown something. Brown something cheese. Brown sugar? Brown sugar cheese. I don't know. Thing. Yeah. <gasps> Guys. This is good. You did a great job. You cooked everything. I was just fishing for a compliment. It worked. Bloop. Now, do we eat this jalapeno? Only if we land on it. That means we should save some food in case we land on it. Because I can't eat that straight up. Can you just eat that straight up? You're a Again, savage. <laughs> it depends on what the jalapeno is. If it's we have no idea. Well, but based on this, it was okay. But that jalapeno could have been unrelated to the jalapeno we ate. Mm. <gasps> we don't know. Can we spin one? We owe one, right? For sure. We got, yeah. Yeah. 
I wouldn't even mind a triple right now because I think it will like distract from the. Oh, okay, ready? Chip up, chip up, spin that wheel. Is that going to be our merch? I don't know if I want that to be. Is it triple? Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh no, further. Hey, oh, my God. Ah! I can't do it. It almost landed on Hedu Tree. You guys did this to us. You did this to us. Are you happy? I can't eat that. Wait, wait, I can. We decided that we would eat it based off of. Should I cut this in half for us? I'll do it. Oh, the other there. way. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh my God, the ones at the AC, not AC fair, <laughs> OC fair. Those are oh, effing oh. hot. Like I will get grab like a napkin and just like wipe my tongue. Uh, Hannah, I'm gonna ask you that question, and everyone else in the chat can answer this. Were you guys the party type in college or not? What do you guys think? I know, Desiree, we warn people, do not wear headphones. I might even do like a um, overlay that says no headphones here, please. Dan, thank you so much for the encouragement. Is, that, okay. is your last name hot though? Dan hot? Because this might be hot and I'm not ready for this. Okay, out of these two pieces, which one do you want? Just give me whatever. They look very- um, Identical? No, like anatomical part, almost. This one has more seats, I think. No, no, oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I, got I got confused. Do you see why I hesitated? Oh, this is spicy. Oh, it smells spicy. Oh, guys. No, Lilybeth, we're not allowed to take the seeds. This is part of the punishment. Oh, why don't we make our own stuffed jalapeno with the bacon oh, bits? Oh, I, that might be good, because that'll distract me from how spicy it is. And make sure you grab some bacon, too. Yeah, let's do. Let's make our own stuffed jalapeno. Look at this. Look how gorgeous this looks. We're a TikTok trend now. <laughs> no one's going to make a whole pot of grits just to put it on a half. You don't of know. You, girl, you've seen the stuff on the internet. Sometimes you're like, why did that become a thing? Well, I saw someone do something. I was like, okay, I saw that five years ago, and someone put it on TikTok and became viral. What was it? Um, what is it? This person did this, and people are going crazy. But I'm like, but I you seen, seen this it? on like a like a Facebook video five years ago. Mm. Anyways, okay. Hmm. Not yet. No jalapenos. Serrano for sure. Is can be spicier than jalapeno, but the thing about jalapeno though, if you actually look at the Scoville chart, it, oh, I don't know if that would help. Would it? I don't know, I don't, I, maybe it does. Sitting here and doing nothing is not doing anything though. But jalapeno, the range of jalapeno could be something as not spicy like a bell pepper, all the way to even spicier as like a like a habanero, like you, you like, it, you, Habanero, I mean, jalapeno for some reason has that wide range and you don't know what you're going to get. So that's the problem with jalapenos. It's never consistent. I'm not being rude, but I'm not listening to you right now. I know you're saying fact. It's spicy because of what was spicy before and it's like re-triggering the spicy. But it's not spicy. It's a hop, It's a bell pepper to you. They should. Yeah, right Just do it. That Thai chili pepper was for sure spicier than this. It was spicier, but it's like building. I don't know. I'm sorry. So can you summarize what you just said? <laughs> Scoville this, Scoville that. Jalapeno, you just never know what you're going to get. Mm, oh, like a box of chocolates. Hey, we have to act out of steam. Should we do Forrest Gump? Did you ever watch Forrest Gump? But I don't remember enough like to know mm. a scene. Woo! It gives it a good crunch. Actually, it actually tastes good. People are feeling bad for James. He's not enjoying his food as much. I am. He is. It's actually this is a little. This is way better than the Thai chili. The thai chili. I feel like the Thai chili <clears throat> tastes better with. 
like the Asian food we eat. I don't know. It, it kind of fell out of place with this dish. It just gives it heat. <laughs> I think I'm spice drunk. Is there such a thing? I'm not like alcohol drunk. I'm spice drunk. I'm like, oh, it's like when when something's so delirious. Like, when something so horrible happens to you, you just become delirious. I could see that. Yeah. Or when you stay up all night and suddenly like you you should be tired, but then you have this extra like weird drunk this high going on. Mm. Yeah. The grits are good. Yeah. And the pan is beautiful. I can't get over this. The pan is nice. Oh, Josephine says, eat some ketchup. You want some ketchup? Mm, I'm good now. It, a, okay, the jalapeno. The shall pass and the it jalapeno has. wasn't that spicy, but what James said earlier, it has a little kick to it, so it re-triggered the Thai chili taste in your mouth, right? That's what but it's all mean. gone now. Yeah. Now it feels like I eat something spicy and it's like good. It's good, yeah. Candace says it releases dopamine and endorphins. Does that mean I'm going to be horny later? <laughs> I don't think those two means horny. Anything that's released from my body means I'm horny. If I sweat, I'm horny. If I do this, I'm like, I'm like you in for a treat. <laughs> eat more Thai chili. Oh, no. Don't eat Thai chili. Pepper. Oh, give me another one. Just kidding. I don't Uh, Michael Lee, Michael, I don't actually never, did we ever ask you how to pronounce your last name? Let's try. I'm going to say Lefebvre. I'm going to say Lefebvre. Lefebvre. I would have read it like you, but I just wanted to just, be have it, just be different. Well, you can affirm. You got to stick around because we owe you dessert still, right? Are we oh. at 150 yet? Likes? I know oh, we yeah, have 125. We do have, yeah, we oh, do have. Oh, it's this you can get it all done. I can see flames in the back. That's so funny. We ate something spicy the other day, too. And people were like, I see the flames in the back. Well, oh, was it the spring rolls with the Thai chili pepper, too? Those what did we eat on Friday, though? This most recent Friday? No, we had just the uh, linguine a la bolonghe. <laughs> You're not even saying it right still. I forgot already. I don't know. Joy said it like so many times. She's like, they're not even listening to me anymore. <laughs> we have really bad short-term memory. No, it's not. I think it's because it's it's like a unique word to have to pronounce. Like, we're not going to remember. Yeah. Mm. Need another bite and then. No, I think I ate a lot of grits earlier. <laughs> really? Let me check. Oh, it's not, it's not as bad as like those noodle nights that we've had. When we eat like. Five packs of noodles each. Wow. And now we have bacon all week, too. I can make bacon and eggs for breakfast. Oh, we do have eggs. We bought. We just bought a carton. At the market, they only had ones that were, like, expiring soon. <gasps> so all the eggs that we normally would buy, because we, we like to get the happy, cage-free, like, you know, humane raised whatever like chicken eggs yeah so all those kinds they were all like had a lifespan of like a week or two like those chickens they actually do pilates too mm. right like they live that lifestyle yeah they're you pay premium dollars healthier for that. than us yeah you know what tvl they're, that's a good question breakfast in bed i don't think we've ever done breakfast in bed ever we don't eat in bed well you know food I don't think I'm trying to this think. Is not, it's just not. Do you guys eat breakfast in bed in general? Should we try that over the break? It's just like, but the eggs Benedict can get everywhere. Yeah, I don't know. Like, yeah, I mean, the I, sound of it sounds nice, but what's the point? Is it so that you don't have to get up and like someone's treating you as soon as you wake up? That's I true. mean, I kind of want to like 
wash my face a little bit. Like you want brush my teeth. Yeah, you want. I feel like you would want to get like ready for something, but like you wouldn't just like wake up and be like, okay. Or I want to wear like a nice robe. Okay. And then have breakfast, you know. But if you're like half naked, like what if? No, what if you spill like? Or what if I get confused and I'm like, wait, that's not the breakfast sausage. Breakfast sausages are like patties, aren't they? No, the other kind, the links. They're greasy too. I shower. That's okay. You perspire overnight. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Um, Joshua says, I only eat one thing in bed. Girl. Do we, Wait, girl. Do we want to know what that is? Longanisa, right? A little, a little kielbasa, a little bit of sausage. You know, that's cool. I'm good with that. James really liked them grits, eh? I love these grits. These were good. We actually should probably tidy up a little bit. You know what? We're a little bit ahead of schedule, which is nice. Usually the cooking was more, but it was still same level of stress. No? I wasn't stressed. Me either. The spice stressed me out, guys. I'm sorry. Um, you know what? So I'm going to clear this out. Maybe I need you to think about what to do for dessert, though. Angel poop. Oh, and, angel poop. And the, the, the um, toffee. toffee brittle. Got it. And save that for another day. Which one? And that too. And that too. We're going to have a smorgasbord for dessert then. Are you guys ready for that? So, Mark, you take over the chat. I'm going to tidy up a little bit. We got some melted butter. Is any of the dessert going to be good with bacon? Because we have no shortage of bacon, girl. We got a lot of bacon. Maybe we'll give Joshua pea bacon because I think that's what he eats in bed only. Bacon. It's like the... Dog treat commercial when the dog's like bacon bites, bacon, oh, bacon, bacon bites. We never bought that for him. The no. bacon strips. The bacon strips, the bacon strips. The bacon strips. Bacon strips. The commercial actually didn't make me want to buy it. I don't know if you felt that way, but I was kind of like. Ooh. I mean, it was kind of cute, but I wouldn't. I don't imagine Hattie sounding like that. So it kind of <laughs> turns me off. It ruined the illusion. I don't want Hattie to be like. Bacon bite, bacon, bacon bite. I was like, oh, no, girl. Hattie, don't sound like that. Can you tell everyone about how you and Hattie scared me this morning? Um, so bad. Yeah, so, like, Hattie has bad allergies. So, like, sometimes, and I'm a very light sleeper. So, like, even though we put, oh, he came out. Oh, my gosh, where is he? Do you see him? Oh, no. You kind of see him a little. He just came out. But um, so in the middle of the night, like we are constantly bickering because like I catch him like licking his paw or whatever. And then I like, how do you stop it? And, you know, I just kind of, you know, slap like whatever he's licking. So he stops. And then um, so we've done that all night long last night. And then, um, so this morning when I got ready for work, James was still in bed. He was deep asleep. And then I wanted to take Haru out for his morning walk. But Haru was also deep in sleep. So he didn't know what was going on. So as soon as I went to go grab Haru on the bed, I think Haru, his last memory of me was when I was like scolding him for oh, the game. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. So without him even realizing, I was just simply trying to pick him up. He thought I was going to slap him. Or like licking his paw or whatever so he was like so he did one of those like rah, 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 like he was like don't do that and then but then as Hedy was doing that Hedy was like spun in a circle and he was facing james face to face when he was like rah, 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 and james woke up it's like ah, ah, ah. i don't even know what sound you made i don't even know like, what sound i made it either. was the most like uh, you know like in the 1950s when they make those or 1920s when they make those movies and like they faint extra dramatically or they scream like, ah, you know, like that kind of acting. It sounded exactly like that. Wait, what does that look like? Oh, it looks like a foot. No, but like cover this part and this part's extending. <laughs> the bacon grease just made a penis on our little like paper. I'm sorry. Yeah, that scared me. And then I was so embarrassed, but then I showered and I never even said goodbye to you this morning. Yeah. I like my paws too. That's cool. I'm gonna take a bite of this and then we'll do dessert after.
One bite? No. <laughs> It didn't sound like an air siren. I don't think so. I was very like, it was like, like a again, but, like a nineteen thirties black and white movie, and like some like predators coming out of like the woods, woods, and the the, the main female character like, ah, and like just faints into someone's arm. Like it sounded like that. Oh, I see what you're saying. Girl. How are you okay? Oh, I'm okay. Are we ready for dessert? Yeah. Okay, maybe the black plate? We only have one, is that okay? Mm -hmm. I think we only have we'll one. We'll just put in the center. And then this is, uh, we want to do a special shout out to Sean IRL and also um, Judy for supplying us with today's dessert. So Sponsored by... <laughs> Summer IRL and Judy Dillinger. So Judy made these two for us. So this is uh, uh, a toffee cracker brittle, maybe. And this one is called Angel Poop. Oh God, this is going to take out somebody. And then Sean IRL, uh, actually his dad baked us. Look at this. We'll open it. I need to grab a knife. Like, lift it though. I, I, it looks like it's not heavy. No, but I. You could take out somebody. I I wanted a piece earlier before we start filming, so I tried to get it out of the bag. But I was like, oh, this is a lot. So. Why haven't you gotten an espresso machine yet? This would have been a perfect time. No, you keep saying I have pour over, but like, no, we need an espresso. I don't drink coffee, but I think Mark should get it because he likes coffee. Well, you know, it is Christmas, and the last three digits of my security code is. <laughs> okay, so let's open up this. So this is a, um, what was it, an apple? Is it apple? Ben no, is there a banana? No, something bread. Apple? <laughs> Wait, just ask him. Are you here? Oh my god, this looks beautiful. We're not it is pretty. Oh my gosh. It's already pre-sliced. Yeah, oh it is. Oh, that's oh, kind of nice. It's already sliced for us. Okay. So you don't even need that. You just grab it. I don't know. I'm just gonna have to use it to. Oh yeah. It there's banana in there, I think. Oh, or is so that banana. walnut? <laughs> I thought it was banana bread, but um but like the text messages that I saw, I remember reading. I, I, I know for sure there's apple. In. Well, when we taste it, we can see how good our taste buds are. And we will spin that wheel in a moment. And Ati Cheryl says, you make me laugh. You said you're full and you finished the grip. I don't even remember saying I'm full. I don't remember. That's how like. No, I said I was full. Oh. I said I was full. I don't know. Maybe I said I was full. Can we spin the wheel before we start yeah. dessert? All right. Let's. There's spin. no spicy things left, right? No, there's okay, good. Let's yes. spin that wheel. We haven't landed on the subscriber giveaway in a while. I hope it lands right. on that. I hope it lands on the underwear on head. <gasps> no way, but who does it? We choose? Oh, we rock, paper, scissors, or is this everyone does it? Underwear on head? Why? Apple walnut bread. There you go. Oh, so it is apple. So who? Do we each? What was your intention? Like, kind of like the chipple where we just do paper rock scissors. Okay, maybe. fine. So then, whoever. But but I was also just oh, I I didn't have a thought either. So they're both. Everyone's saying both, of course. Who wants to go first? We have to wear it for the rest of the stream, girl. I can't look like some fool when I'm singing. But granted, one can argue I look like a fool just singing. So do you want me to get the underwear for my head first or you? One of us has to go. We both can't leave though. Just swap current underwear? No, girl, that is nasty. So are you gonna go or me? Go. Which underwear do I do? Do I choose the one that will be comfortable or do it like, or do I do the one where it's like? Are they all different sizes? No, you, before I, when I come back, do you guys have categories of underwear? You have like the, 
like, I want to be sexy in this underwear. I don't mind you seeing it. And then I have the other one where it's like, girl, I don't want to touch you underwear, underwear. Girl, I know you have two kinds. You act like you all. No, I try to underwear. only use the ones where I will look, look good, and because just in case, I call I call bull ass. All right, they're one of my favorite pair. No, now I don't wear them anymore. But my favorite pair hey. actually had holes in it, so I kept wearing it until I was like, okay, I can't wear it anymore. But it was my favorite pair. Um, no, but. I just remember the saying, like, you always want to wear underwear where you don't mind someone seeing because, like, you could get into a car accident and the the paramedic hot guy could maybe have to take your pants off for medical reasons. Like, you don't want to be embarrassed, right? Okay, I grabbed it, but I'm not putting it on until you grab yours and we just put it on at the same time. What? I didn't even know what criteria. Like, when I opened my underwear drawer, I was like, there's, like, options like i do have calvin klein's but i also have the other ones that are like my more everyday wear and then i have the ones where i was like i wouldn't be caught dead wearing these anywhere either stray cat thank you so much for the super chat we really appreciate it i think james picks mark's undies and mark picks james's undies to wear you know what have you ever underwear swapped there's something like oddly like titillating about that that's all i'm gonna say i'll leave you with that thought well you know <gasps> what i know what you did because i know we just did laundry so you, did you grab it from the dryer no i went to my underwear drawer oh, that, which the, one did you choose the one in the dryer yeah that's fine oh because the dryer door was open so i thought you just went in there no I, did you not see me go to the other no, i didn't see you yeah so I just grabbed the first one I saw in the dryer. Yeah, I'm just doing this. This is like, like modest. Like I got oh, yeah, it at Target. Is, yeah, and this like, is modest too. Yeah. So yeah. we just put this on our damn head. Like, why are we doing this? I don't know. Girl. Ready? Do we show? Wait, do, which way? part is the crotch facing the back way? No, it should be like how real life is. So the butt should be in the back. Oh. Crotch is in the front. Okay. Wait, is that right? These aren't musty, are they? Okay. <laughs> Wait, and the waist. Oh, go ahead. The waistband is like really. Um, it's like really. Uh, oh, it's <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh gosh. I, I feel like I need to tie it up like this to make it look cool. I'm like slowly. <gasps> okay, how. I look like I'm doing like, like church work somewhere. <laughs> Okay, I don't I don't think the don't, rest of the night. I think just for a minute or two. I'm gonna <laughs> This is so this embarrassing. Is this is really embarrassing. Oh my hey, god. at least it kind of matches my shirt though. Oh my god, DJ Skidmark. <laughs> hey, that's cute. Don't try to like make it look cuter. We're supposed to be like punished. Okay, let's try eat our dessert. Okay. Quality content hotties. Happy holidays. Thank you so much. Stray Cat also super chatted us and Candace just gifted us with the super chat as well. Oh, Thank so, you so, so much. Let's do our shot. Let's, just, yeah, we'll do let's drink so that we can forget that my freaking underwear is on my head, you know? Why did where what even compelled you to think of this? I just don't even know. If you guys want Mark to do the Wheel of Wonder next week, let us know in the chat. That's fine. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. No, next week should be you have to pull up you have to pull an underwear from the dirty hamper. <laughs> a random one. Ew. Like literally DJ skip mark. Now, in that when we were doing the cooking part of the video, we had less people on, but right now we've just hit our peak. You just want do we should just do all our thumbnails. Well, that that should be the name of our channel, like two guys, two underwears on their heads. That, that's exactly where you're going to get when you come on our stream. Yeah. Let's try this. Okay. After you. Okay. Let's eat the uh, angel poop first. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh, my God. You t oh, my God. It's like a buttered popcorn, but with white chocolate. Like I It's exactly that. I miss... 
Oh my god! I miss the ta- this. We haven't had this for like three, like. Three well, there's years? that, but like, mm. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like when I go to the movie theater and I get buttered popcorn, it never tastes like the movie theater. This gives me that feeling like I'm eating, like I'm watching a movie. I'm eating popcorn in one hand and like M and M's or something chocolatey in the other, and they're just like together. Yeah. Oh my god, is- my mouth is like. Sl- like, it, this is good. Floodgate of Salah. Did you just? It was it getting my way. Good. Keep that on later. <laughs> Keep that on later, okay? Oh, that's all I'm going to say. Brenda, that's why you cannot leave. I went away for a few seconds and came back to see them with their underwear on their head. You just never know what's going to happen here. Cool. Um, when do we take down the tree? You know what? The tree stays up for probably like right after Christmas. Well, here's the thing. I only have one. I, it, I'm a hypocrite because I have a rule about when we could put up Christmas decoration. And it has to be after Thanksgiving. Like for me, I'm kind of like, strict about that but about when to take it down i don't have a heart you're a little bit more loosey about it, right? Lucy, yeah. yeah judy thank you so much merry christmas market it's it's delicious thank you judy we still right. haven't had the toffee cracker yet so we'll exactly do that exactly how i remember it yeah so what do you want to do next the cracker oh okay mm. Mm. There's something about salty and sweet at the same time. Just go together. Yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. I don't feel guilty eating that one because it's thin. Let me go back to one more of these. Cleanse my palate. You want to take off the underwear yet, or no? Not yet. Now everyone's seen our undies. Do I still have to show? Why would you guys come back now? Next week would be we have to just be in our underwear. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. If we were to do a live stream on Christmas, just a quick poll of the 163 of you who are here. Yeah, would you? Honestly, would you be on? Because if not, then we're like, you know what? We can just Because we don't want to take away from your holiday plans. But we also know this year is kind of different, It's different. We are definitely not really doing anything like special but then again like we don't want to make you feel even obligated to yeah absolutely. if you have other plans or if you just want time for yourself that's okay too yeah so we're just curious we would love to spend time with you all on friday yeah yeah and steven says happy holiday boys looks like you're all having fun food looks baller also Tree goes down end of first week in January for my husband and me. Well, there you go. What's go down? The tree. Oh, the tree goes down. Yeah. The first week of January? Yeah. You know what? That's not bad. I think I would. First I think, week of January let's seems just do good. That because you know why? Um, I don't know why, but I feel like Christmas is the last day of December or the last day of the year, but it's not. There's always, there's one more week. Yeah. There. But, I, one more but week. Some, for some reason, since I was a kid, my mind just immediately thinks, oh, Christmas, last day of the year. But no, Mark, New Year's Eve, New Year's Eve is the last day of the year. Hmm. So Kosh says me. Steven says I'd watch. Matthew says we would. Mm-hmm. And Kim Young says do it. I have no plans in the least saddest way possible. I'd watch. Okay. We are not gathering for Christmas. I'm there. No plans, just home. You know, that's good. Maybe that's. That's, I mean, I wouldn't even call ourselves a reward, but that's just the fact that we should all be at home, not out and about. So why not just hang out with each other virtually? It's safe. Yeah. And and you guys can sign on too, and we can chit chat and have a good old time. Someone did say to wear ugly sweaters on that stream, but I don't think we have any ugly sweaters. Just have ugly oh, I, I, oh my God, because James made us do like Marie Kondo. I made an ugly sweater that I was so proud of like maybe three years ago and I just which one was it? It's the one with the <laughs> reindeer throwing up vomiting candy oh, yeah. uh, holiday. But don't candy. you have the one from last year still? No? 
that was just an ugly sweater unrelated to the holidays. Was it was an ugliest Shiba Inu sweater? That was like two years ago, three years ago. And what was last year? You had to make something for work again. There was one year you used duct tape for something. What was that? Oh yeah, I something else. I actually, so that year I thought I was gonna be creative, so I just bought a normal black sweater, and with uh, sequins duct tape. So oh not, yes, so not, so not even normal duct tape because that's too that's like a little like too like cheesy, but fancy. I want to zhuzh it up a little bit, mm-hmm. right? So with like very sparkly duct tape, I spelled out the word ugly. Oh, that's duct right. Tape. Yes, now I remember. Ugly totally remember sweater. that. It's not Christmassy. Panina says, how about ugly underwear? I'm going to eat this one. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my God. This would be a perfect breakfast. Yeah. With cream cheese. We only have salmon cream cheese. Oh, that wouldn't work here, but with cream, this would be perfect with cream cheese on top. Isn't there dishes where they roll the salmon in walnuts? Like crushed walnuts for a skin. For skin? Oh. <laughs> you know, like the crusted fish. Oh, yeah. Maybe pistachios mm. or something. Yeah. Griddle that pig with butter, girl. You guys always have good ideas. Mm. Sean says he's going to wear his Mariah Carey sparkly red gown with a hide side slit. You know what? That's going on the flyer, so we fully expect you to be there then. Make sure you also make some jingle juice for Christmas. Steven, tell us what a jingle juice is. We should make eggnog. That might be fun. I told Mark maybe like saying like two to three like Christmas songs might be fun. And who cares about the monetization? Just so that we feel maybe we can do some giveaways, like where people open up gifts. I don't know. There's a lot of possibilities. We just have to get back to you because that that takes planning. Or our money with your giveaway that they mm, okay. Yeah. Hannah, thank you so much for the super chat. For Christmas, I'm going on a date and to go anything and eat it at a drive-in near GG. Awesome. Oh, Christmas date. How Christmas romantic. Date to... Ooh. Only if it was snowing near GG. Mm, yeah. That would make even more romantic, but I bet you. You're going to have a good time. I love it. So, Hahi, thank you so much. I will watch. Okay, here's a drink. Pink champagne, cherry 7-Up, and a full bottle of whipped vodka. It's a jingle juice. Is that what it's called? Steven, why don't you just come on the stream and show us how to make it in real time? What's pink? The champagne is also pink? Maybe like a rosé champagne? A oh, rosé champagne. Champagne on all. Throw in some cranberries in your golden. That sounds very pretty. Mm-hmm. Don asks, where did you two first meet? Mm, back in college, like five decades ago. I mean, I'm excited. The first students I'm excited. At that university. I'm excited for the new year, but new year is new age, and new age means new wrinkles, and new wrinkles means new sadness. But don't you feel young because, like, honestly, ten minutes ago, you just wore your underwear on the internet. Did you think that this is what we would well, be doing at this technically, age? Technically, I wear underwear every single no. Oh, on your no. head. Ah! Oh my, you're nasty. I don't wear underwear every single time. Today I am. Some days I'm like. Hey, are you wearing underwear? And he's like, no. And then he'll show me a little bit. I'm like, oh, when did I show not, you? Not show me. You would just go like this, just to show like the bare part. Not like, not like flash me, but no. you could do that too. I wouldn't stop you. But sometimes I'm like, that's dangerous. You can't just like free ball it and like go to like the drive through. We're sitting down all the time. Yeah, but like when they when they like give you your food or give you your card back, they could go like this. Oh, when we go to drive through? Yeah. That's why sometimes I ask James. Are we actually leaving the car or just to drive through? Because that matters a lot. Then I don't wear underwear. Okay. Steven says, oh, hush. I turned 32 on January 9th. Girl or boy or whatever you want us to call you. You're still like. Your baby. Your baby. Your baby. 
Un Mora, Mora from Schitt's Creek. Un bebe, bebe. Yo, bebe. Costco used to have eggnog that was 80 proof. Wow. But I don't even like know how to make eggnog. Can we make? Do you? Wait, this is a trivia question. Are there eggs in eggnog? Yes. 100% yes. Final answer? Final answer. Dun, dun, dun. You just want $100. <laughs> dun, 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 that should dun. be the million dollar you think question. So? Like, Wait, it, can you? Some, some people could be like, oh, that, is that a trick question? Okay, so maybe we'll make eggnog on Friday, but I do want to know offhand if you even know how to make it. Like, can we use these eggs that you just bought for that? But we can't make it on the spot and then just drink it. Don't you need to let it like brew? No? Um, I mean, usually it's good cold or chilled. I guess we could drink it. I guess, I think traditionally eggnogs might have been warm, like a mulled wine. I think it's supposed to be a warm drink if I think about it. Because then why would people drink it just for the winter time? Mm. I like to drink it chilled. Yeah, I would only. I don't like hot to drinks. To me, it's like ice period. cream. Like I want my ice cream cold, right? So eggnog to me, I love eggnog. Love it so much. Um, and our our neighbor friend and good friend Matt, he's known to make really his homemade from scratch eggnog, and every single year, I look forward to it. And he's so sweet enough to even remember to make me some, you know, make us some, right? Well, you. I you are I'm his number one. one. No, you are his number one fan. Like one time he hosted a Christmas party a couple years ago and he made a whole big punch bowl of eggnog because he was so proud of it. People could only maybe drink a glass or two. I think I drank from the bowl. Yeah, he did. But it was hard for you to get. Were you drunk that year? It's uh, hard for me to get drunk. There's a lot of like. Else. Yeah, yeah, I need to just do straight up shot, 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 and mm. then I could do it. This is dangerous. Dangerous. I would want to drink coffee with this. Yeah, this is a really good uh, breakfast. It tastes very healthy, too. Mm. With the walnuts. Mm, I've heard of a hotty toddy, but I don't know if I've ever had it. I think I've probably had it before. I don't think I would like it. I don't like it because it reminds me of Theraflu. Oh, girl, don't ruin hotty toddies for everyone else. Hot sake? I prefer cold sake. But I do do hot sake. Well. Joy B says depends on who makes them, but that's the only hot alcoholic drink I like. But what? Which one? Eggnog? Mold wine? Let's guess. Let's see. I'm scrolling, scrolling. You might have missed her. Hotty toddy. Oh, hotty toddy. But what is in it again? I thought it was Rum? like a maybe, but I thought it was like a lemon flavored. Like no, I don't it's think not. there's lemon in it. Why did I? Why do I think of Theraflu? Yeah, I don't know. There's no hot lemon drink, is there? Um, like hot hot lemon tea, maybe. And Chantal says that they take the tree down after everyone's done unwrapping their gifts. That's Ooh. oh, it's like Christmas is over, bam! Take the tree down. It's like as soon as right when you undo the ribbon, the ornament's coming down. No, that's smart because then if you have kids, I'll be like, well, if you want to play with a new PlayStation. Help take down the tree. No, like, I don't, that's a good technique or strategy. I don't know if Angelina's still here, but there was a video where all her kids were helping put up the ornaments on the tree, and I was like, maybe we should have kids. <laughs> they can put up the ornaments on the tree. So, but we might be I love a, it. we might be hard on them. They're like, oh, you need to space out the ornaments. Oh, and and <laughs> she Angelina sent me this meme where like the front side of the tree looks really nice. The back tree is like you wouldn't show that off to anybody and that's true for ours because ours is against the wall yeah. so you don't put any ornaments on the back side because no one's going to see it but we try to do on the side though yeah you see it from this angle but other than that but it's like we did the tree but only like me and mark have seen it this year Hedy doesn't care for the tree yeah. doesn't care for it all right am i grabbing the the microphone or like no i'm reading the room and it's just you you and me. Because obviously if I ask them, they're going to say yes. But 
we also have to plan some stuff this week. And so maybe we can sing. We can save all this. We can save some of the singing for Friday then. How about we do that? If we do it on Friday. But I'm getting the sense that everyone's going to be here. Right? No? Maybe? I'm going to eat some cheese. Can you eat this? Oh, so the hottie potty does have lemon. So I, I have. Oh, you're before. right. And you're like, oh, I've never heard of it. I am interested in the jingle the, juice. How did you get the crackers from the um, toffee brittle on your shoulder? How? There was like at least five big crumpy. Oh, there's another one right here. What if it was from the underwear I put on top of my head earlier? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Girl. Wait, don't say it. Head and shoulder, but more <gasps> like head and balls. For Ew. <laughs> That might be fun to do on Friday, too. Another small version of Truth or Drink. I don't know. Did you guys even learn anything about us that day? I feel like everything we shared was kind of like, you know, vanilla. Nothing like that exciting. The only thing I took away from that was just like, don't go on Brooke Hurston. I'm scared of Brooke Oh, uh, Joy B. Joy B, stay away Broke from Brooke Hurston. her ankle? Broke something. You shouldn't break anything. On Brooker Street. And I called it Brooke Hertz, and I still laugh about that. And that's why I brought it up right now, so I can repeat my joke. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? We had such a great time tonight. What a great Monday. It was a great Monday. What a great we Monday really before enjoyed. December 25th. Before December 25th. You know what? Before you guys leave, though, sign up to our Discord. We absolutely want everyone to be on there. All you need to do is click on the link that's in the description of this video. It'll pop up a message. You set up a username, set up a password, and then you're able to chat with all of the other people who watch James and Mark Mukbang channel. And uh, we aren't even like that. Special shout out to uh, the both Michaels, the Michael, Julie Rooker? Smith, Desiree Bear, uh, Bear the Barrier, Bear the Barrier, K uh, Moves on there, K Moves on there too. Like really, such a great way to. It's another way to build community. Build community, and we all need that right now. I think so too. Like, w like nowadays, it's fun because they're like, wait, 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 take a picture so we put it on Discord. Because I was like, oh, someone's sharing what they're eating. Like Teresa's been doing that a lot. Oh, like, Teresa, she, yeah, she's Teresa, really good about yeah. that. So you use that. Even this past weekend, like the Michaels were testing out the voice chat. You guys can actually voice chat on there. You don't even have to be on camera. You just join this room and then just chit chat with people. Oh. And so I did that for a little bit. They were like, hello. And we're like, hello. hello. Did James sound different? I think there was a comment related to that. I don't know. What? You would sound the same because it's through the video. You know, like, you know, I don't know. James kicked me out of voice chat. Okay, K Mu Young is very specific with, he's telling the truth, but he's not, he's leaving parts of it out. What is that called? It's not lying. He's just selective with what he's sharing. Why did I kick you out of the chat, huh? Say the rest. Was he doing something in that moment? Well, he was at work, and I was just trying to help him out. Huh. You know? Michael says, James sounds subdued. You sounded like you just hit the corner of your vent in your kitchen. My, um, Michael did say that I was very off to the two. Were you? Maybe. I don't know. Were you? It was okay, a stressful girl? day at work. Stressful day at work. I'm, I'm How do you feel now, though? How do you feel now? I'm glad that we did this because it took my mind off the things that I was very stressed about. I but honestly don't I've think been, about anything. I've anymore. been very stressed today. Wait, well, two more days. Two more days and a little bit of respite oh, for I'm you. About to cry. Well, well, you know what? Mark's going to stay up till like one or two. Maybe we can watch Um Jungwa's video like all together in the Discord. We'll just put the video up and we can all do the reaction video. Like, oh my God. Oh, oh my God. I can't wait. Oh, it's coming out. And there has been no preview or, you know, sometimes they release like a small, like. Oh, like a teaser or a snippet. Teaser. Yeah, nothing. None of that. You don't just, know. Just her image. Just her poster. Yeah. But wearing leopard. Print. Thousand percent. It doesn't matter what she's going to put out. You're just, he is. Mark will be that loyal. He's the most loyal if you are in his, like, you know. Once I like you, then I'll be loyal. Forever. So, so okay, like, you better be careful. 
Who are you, who are you threatening on our stream? I'm a leech. I'll never let go. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Steven, nurse here, 2020 new stress level chief. We know we really thank you for everything that you're doing, all the healthcare workers that are out there keeping the rest of us. Hopefully those of us who are watching the stream are just keeping it together, staying home. You know, you guys are staying home. You're watching us here. Yeah. This is a low risk. We're from the same household. So yeah. Anyways, love you guys. We don't any we don't owe anything else, right? I feel like we left without oh, we did everything. We had dessert. We don't owe the wheel spins or nothing. We're good, yeah. right? Okay, we're we're good. Maybe we'll see you Friday. Love you guys. Have a great rest of your week. And if we don't see you, Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Bye. Oh my God, it feels like you just won like a pageant. You're on a float and you're kissing all your fans. Say goodbye to the peoples. There you go. Oh, there you've missed that person. Okay, bye.